We just got brand new iPhone 6s, which means that we don't have the equipment to put it on a podium, and that is awkward. But we have outrageous predictions to make. We're back in the season. We're back in the groove. Feeling real good about it. Doug, could you just stop being weird for five seconds? That'd be great. Okay, why don't you just go ahead and give them your outra outrageous prediction first. Uh, Jack Willoughby will kick hey. nine field goals. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's Bill great. Landis obsessed with the, with the uh, fifth year kicker from Duke. Wow. I'm gonna say, I think this is a, I think this is gonna be a game. And I think Ohio State's better, that's not outrageous, but I think Virginia Tech will lead at the half. I think the quarterback situation will be interesting. I think there are enough pieces on offense um, that you wonder about Braxton in his new role, uh, the, the other wide receiver spot other than Michael Thomas. Yes, there's lots of things to depend on with the offensive line, um, with the, the starting quarterback, whoever it is. Uh, but I think Virginia Tech's going to be fired up at home. You know, Ohio State's used to playing big road games. That's not new. I'm not saying Ohio State's not going to win. I'm saying they're not going to be ahead of the half. That was intense. <laughs> uh, Jack Willoughby's going to kick seven field No. Oh. <laughs> He's from Duke. Uh, my outrageous prediction for this game is that Virginia Tech will not score a touchdown, which I think is the same outrageous prediction I made for the Michigan game last year, which obviously I don't think I've ever been right. But it's based on the fact that I just don't think Virginia Tech's offense is very good. I think the defense is, and I think it's going to be not like a – it's not going to be a 60-point win for Ohio State, and we'll get that when we make our game picks. Um, I just don't think Virginia Tech can move the ball up and down the field on Ohio State. Last year, I think Virginia Tech's offense had some success because Ohio State's defense was on the field for a lot of the game because Ohio State really struggled to move the ball on, on its end. Um, so I think Virginia Tech might get three or four field goals, but they're not going to score a touchdown. Mine is that Braxton Miller will not catch a pass. And I know that sounds crazy, and he's probably going to probably catch a pitch, which is going to count as a reception. Yes. But, but Will might give you a pass on it. How about this? How about catch a pass five yards downfield? How about, how about let's give you, if it's the jet sweep, basically a handoff, and that's the only, he, only reception okay, he so, has, Okay, but I'm still wrong win. if he gets a bubble screen. Yeah, bubble screen is Okay, still so any pass, pass that has to travel more than three yards in the air to hit his arms. I just, I just think that he's going to be a playmaker. I think he is very good and has always been a very dynamic athlete and explosive with the ball, but I think it takes more than three weeks to learn a new position. And I just don't know if he's at the point right now in his progression as an H-back where he's going to be running all over the field, catching passes, and doing things that people might be envisioning right now. Are they going to throw to him? I think the they'll throw to him. Be I think they'll throw to him, especially given the fact that the H-back situation is a little bit weak without Jalen Marshall and Dontre Wilson. So I think that he's going to have his opportunities. I'm really excited to see how he looks as a punt returner, but I'm just not – sure he's at that point yet. I think they're going to try to get him the ball, but I think it's going to be a work in progress. So that's our outrageous predictions. Does your hat say Braxton? It says Braxton on it. It doesn't. But hopefully this is the last week you're going to have to deal with me holding my arm hurts. I like this. Uh, we, get the, uh, we get the podium and the... All right, that's enough. That's it. Thank you. Goodbye.